Hi, beautiful Pilates enthusiasts. I've moved to the other end of the Cadillac for a really nice movement I learned as Flying Eagle. Uh, done on top of the table. However, it also can be done on the floor just outside the frame. Alrighty, I've moved everything to the other end just for filming. And uh, the crossbar is still here. I could move it all the way down, but it won't be in our way. We place the middle of the ball of the foot so you do need adequate dorsiflexion in the ankle on the frame. You start with the uh, arms, the elbows at 90 degrees, and then straighten the arms. And I always tell the client, this is the last time you bend your arms. Now the arms will remain straight. I will breathe in. As I exhale, I'm flexing. So I'm kind of pressing my feet against the frame just a little bit. We're avoid dropping down. You're creating a flexion into your spine. Lift it. Then I press the pelvis forward, come to a diagonal neutral. Inhale, lifting the breastbone toward the ceiling and arc back. Be aware of your neck. All right? Neutral. Inhale, exhale to the flex spine position. You're allowing your body weight to help you. Just kind of wait for gravity. Inhale, bring your pelvis up. Feel the lift of the breastbone. Exhale, and you arc back. So if you've got the movement of a little more hip extension than I'm showing you, go for it. Just be sure your spine is in that energetic line. So if you're super bending your lower back, you gotta be careful you're not dumping to the low spine, right? Oh, so good. One more time, breathing out. I can hyperextend my knees very easily, so I have to be very aware there. I'm not doing that. Breath, open and wide across the chest. Oh my gosh, feels so good. It's a really nice one to uh, end your sessions with, and your clients will really think you're the greatest. Check it out, Flying Eagle.